It's Fernando Ruiz Art. Hi, everybody. Today, we're going to be drawing something special. We're going to be drawing Bughead. You guys know what Bughead is? Well, Bughead is, I'm sure you guys who, who watch Riverdale regularly, you guys probably know what Bughead is. Bughead is the nickname given to the, the unusual pairing of Jughead, Archie's pal Jughead, with Betty. Um, and believe it or not, that is actually kind of a popular pairing. It, it's, you know, I do get asked for that. Um, maybe not a lot, but it, it's not as rare as you might think. So this is a private commission. So somebody uh, has requested this pairing. So there you go. Um, now this also, uh, in terms of our usual lessons, this does give us the opportunity to see how we can draw two characters interacting, uh, which is not always um, a very easy thing to do. Um, in fact, a lot of us will wrestle with a singular character, let alone when you have two characters interacting with each other. Uh, for example, if they're fighting, if they're dancing, and so forth. Um, things get a little more complicated. Uh, and you can see I am roughing these guys out, and I'm, I'm trying to move quickly, swiftly, all over the, the figures. Um, again, you know what, what's key here to drawing two figures interacting like this is to just about treat them as a singular figure. Don't work on one character, finish that character, and then move on to the next one. Um, because what will happen is they, they just won't, they won't play well together. They won't, they might not match up. So I, I treat the two figures almost like one fused two-headed monster. Um, and as, as usual, as, as I've often pointed out, I like to work all over the figure. Let me clean up these legs a little bit because it got a little messy there. Uh, give Jughead a bit of a hand here. I'm not worried about getting too careful at this moment. I just want to just get their bodies down. And, you know, I'll try to keep them in proportion, but I'm not I'm not 100 percent concerned about about making everything perfect just yet as I go. And now, you know, now that I have the, this basic body down, scribbled down. Now I could go in and start to tweak things. I could also start to suggest certain details, like Jughead's hat. I've said this before, whenever I've drawn Jughead, usually, usually I, I try to get that hat on his head fairly early because um, uh, it does dictate so much about the rest of him. You know, it really affects, at least when I'm drawing him, it really affects much of the rest of his head. So, and I'm, I'm also, you're seeing me scribble in Jughead's face a little bit here. Uh, a little early for that, but, you know, sometimes, sometimes I'll indulge in some details. And also, too, um, truth be told, I often move uh, faster. Well, I almost always move faster in these videos than uh, than I would if I were just drawing this uh, without the camera on. Um, mostly because you know I I, I want to get the lesson out, but I don't want to take you guys through the the chore of every little tweak and and scribble and line because um, I would probably make for a much longer video. So. Uh, and if you guys follow me on social media, and I hope you do, I always have my links in the description below. 
if you follow me on social media, I usually post the stuff that, um, that I work on in these videos on my uh, social media, Instagram, Facebook. Yeah, I'm on Twitter, but honestly, I don't really, I don't really Twitter that much. Um, uh, so you can see the stuff that I work on there. Uh, and if you know, if you look carefully, you'll notice there's often uh, some changes between when I finish them here in, in the video and then when I post them. Um, and certainly by the finish stage. And that's because, you know, usually after these videos, I go in and I have to, uh, you know, I'll, I'll go in and I'll fix, uh, I'll fix things. I'll take a, I'll take a second look at some of the stuff um, that I did during the video and uh, I'll tweak it. I'll, uh, you know, I'll question it, fix it. You know, because, you know, once the cameras stop rolling, then I have a lot more time to take things a little slow. So I guess my, my lesson here, my point here is don't rush through this stuff. You know, I, I know I sometimes make it look fast and, and fairly easy, but, um, you know, I'm just, I'm just trying to get a, a 10 minute video done for you guys. Um, your drawings should probably take you more than 10 minutes and, and it's not unusual. If it does, don't, don't feel like uh, you're doing anything wrong. So I'm moving around, how's this jughead look? I, and again, I, I like to bounce around all over the figure. So all over both figures too. So I may be tweaking Jughead's head a little bit. Go back to Jughead. Always step back and, and just take in your, your drawing, your piece as a whole. Um, you may want to animate Betty's ponytail a little bit more just to use some of that space and to just make her look more fun, a little crazier. And now I could start to detail this stuff a little bit more as I move down on Betty. She's holding on to Jughead here. Jughead, of course, has his trademark S. What does the S stand for? Uh, that might be a whole other video. We could talk about that. There are theories. There are theories out there. Okay. So, as I said, this is a uh, private commission. Uh, somebody reached out to me on, on social media. And if you, if anybody out there ever wants a private commission of their own, uh, just, just send me a private message or reach out to me on my email address, uh, Fernando Ruiz, everybody at gmail.com. Reach out to me. Um, and we could we could talk pricing and rates and that sort of thing. Uh, I have certain set rates for some things, um, but those rates um, might be affected depending on the specifics of, of what you want. Um, but we could always you know if you if you ever if there was ever a drawing you ever wanted from me any any character any favorite character. And I don't do, of course, just Archie. If you, if you again, look at my stuff on Instagram and uh, Facebook and just look over my portfolio at FernandoRuizEverybody.com and you'll see that I, I can, I can kind of swing a variety of different characters. So these guys are just about done, at least at the pencil stage. Uh, the commissioner, of course, the buyer wants uh, inks and and full color, so I will be doing that. Um, if you guys want to watch me do go through those steps, um, let me know, of course, in the in the comments below. Uh, by the way, once again, I, I'll remind you guys we are very close to a to a milestone number of subscriptions. So um, thanks to everybody who has subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, you know, please do so. Um, please subscribe, share, 
rake, wake the neighbors and the, and the kids and, and get them to subscribe and share as well. So Jughead's pants will most likely be black, but I'm gonna leave those open here. So let me just tweak Betty's face a little bit again. Let's get in there close so you can see what I'm doing. Give Betty some nice big eyelashes. She's looking lovingly at Jughead. And Jughead, he loves getting Betty's attention. And so much so that these guys are going to be oozing hearts all around them. That's always, that's always a cute touch. Nothing says, I love you, like human hearts hovering around your heads. So, what do you think? Is that, uh, is that, does that look okay? Did I capture the essence of Bughead? Um, if I want to, of course, I could keep tweaking this. I could keep tightening this up. Um, and believe me, I think most artists, uh, it's very easy for us to over tweak and over tighten and, and we could keep noodling something forever. So at some point, you know, you just gotta, you just gotta say it's done and, and walk away. Um, and this is probably good. I may, I may tighten up a few little things because I do want, I do have to ink this and I will be coloring it. Like I said, if you wanna see that happen, um, let me know. I'll, I'll gladly make a video of that too. Um, but I think we are good and, uh, I will, uh, you know, if you, if you like this, let me know in the, uh, comments below. If you have ideas for other odd pairings of Archie characters, or even not Archie characters, let me know. Um, uh, and any other thoughts, comments, complaints, criticisms, always put them in the comments below. Um, thanks for tuning in. I hope you liked this. If you did, click like, subscribe, and come back and we'll do this again. Thanks a lot, everybody. Keep drawing. Keep drawing.